Okay, so what we've got right here, wait a minute. Can, can you see that right there? I guess not. It's on the outside of the screen. It looks like my dog's nose. There's a smudge. It's 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 right there. Uh, okay, let me clean my screen off and we'll start this again. Hello, friends, and welcome. We're going to cheat the uh, nylon engine mount. But before we do, a special thank you to over 400 subscribers. Appreciate every bit of that. You just don't know. Okay, many of you have already dealt with these nylon things. And, of course, you can just take your engine, set it in there, get it set right about where you want it, and then you know where to drill the holes, except, well, you got to have some long drill bits. And so the first time I tried it, it's okay, I'm going to go get long drill bits. So I did. And, yeah, plenty long, plenty clumsy, but it got the job done. Now we're going to fast forward to today with a precision laser and make a little template to drill into the nylon and set the engine just right. This part here is not super hard. Essentially, I started out, got me a... My favorite measuring implement, and this base square right through there is uh, basically what I was going to need. Now I can add, as I did here, I can add a little extra on front and back. Couldn't go any further side to side, and uh, but I used this to come through and measure where to put the holes, and then measured the hole. They were three millimeter diameter holes. And so I used this black line to center, measure to the center where to put the hole, set that there, and then the red line to where to center that. And then just simply duplicated those two and use my left arrow key and move these over to approximately right in the middle. Should be just about right. And then went through and traced out what I wanted after I got everything measured and in place, traced out what I wanted from a pattern. So then I was able to move this all over here at one piece, select all of it, and group that together. Cut that out on the laser. And that's pretty much got your template set up. So a pretty simple little deal. I, uh, I used some eighth inch hardwood you know light ply or basswood or something so it'll last a while in case i ever have to use it again i could have inscribed the engine on there i did not uh so i'll take a pencil or a marker or something and put this on there and keep it in the shop in case i ever have to mount that engine again i will have the exact template and all i gotta do is drill the holes out mount the engine Thank you all for stopping by. Appreciate the over 400 subscribers. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And uh, come back to see us next time.